Hello YouTube, today I'm going to do a review on IOBit Uninstaller. Now I am currently having a problem with my uninstaller with Windows because I'm trying to uninstall Adobe Dreamweaver which is currently playing up for me at the moment so I've decided I wanted to uninstall it so that I can then reinstall it but unfortunately when I go into uninstall programs and then click on it and click uninstall it comes up with this lovely little error here so obviously I'm not going to click yes on that because if I click yes it's just going to get rid of this icon here but if you go straight into um, my computer you can see that all of the stuff is still actually attached in here so just by clicking yes would have only got me to get rid of it on what the computer thinks is uninstalled so if I go here all these things are here so just by pressing yes all this would have still stayed here and unfortunately I still can't get rid of it and it's no point in just deleting it because it doesn't officially uninstall the program so that's why IOBit uninstaller is hopefully going to do the job for me so what you do is you just click on the application that you want to delete click uninstall it will say are you sure you want to uninstall the selected programs yes I do and then it gives an op um, it does a um, uninstall mode so you can either do standard or advanced so I'm going to just do a powerful scan so it says scan for leftover items in the registry and on the hard drive so I'll do a powerful scan now this might may take a little while for you if you're doing it at home and obviously because it is uninstalling a program it doesn't take seconds to do that so it will take a little while for me as well so what I will do is I'm going to um, pause this video and okay and now we're back so it's now done its scan and as you can see it's showing absolutely everything that has been left over by Adobe Dreamweaver which basically shows you what needs to be deleted so now this is all selected we're just going to click on here actually no we'll just click on um, select all there we go and it now gives you the option to delete every single file that Adobe Dreamweaver has actually created that is obviously just system files not files that you've like exported and stuff so don't worry about that but it's just basically what makes Dreamweaver work so press delete are you sure yes I'm sure I want to get rid of this thing because it's annoying me and now it will just do a deletion of all of the files and this may take once again a little while so I will pause the video when okay and now it's done it says delete finished so press OK on that and now it's come away from this actual list here so you can't see Adobe Dreamweaver CS6 but just to make sure it's 100% gone we we'll go to computer and then go to my local disk program files then go to Adobe and look at that CS6 there's only that and that is just empty files full of rubbish which you can actually delete so if I go to here press delete continue it will then delete them folders because there's actually nothing in there and the only reason that they didn't actually delete from the program was because these are administration folders which basically means you have to have permission to delete them so there we go that's that done there is actually now nothing whatsoever of Dreamweaver CS6 which unfortunately the uh, Windows one couldn't do so this is a successful program so use IOBit uninstaller I will put the link in the description for you and hopefully the same thing will happen with you and you can get them annoying programs that just won't uninstall uninstalled so thank you for watching this video and I will see you in my next one